Is your fire stick running slow? Then you are at the right place. Here is how to fix the issue. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. Method 1. Power cycle the fire stick. Sometimes due to bugs and errors, the fire stick can run slow. To fix minor bugs and errors, first of all restart the fire stick and the TV. Navigate to settings, select my fire TV, select restart, select restart again. You can also shut the device off and keep them unplugged for few minutes. Then plug them back and check. Method 2. Clear your cache. Clearing the app cache on your Fire Stick can help improve its performance and resolve various issues. Excessive cache data can cause lag and buffering issues while streaming. Clearing the cache can help provide a smoother streaming experience. Now here is how to clear app cache on Fire Stick. Navigate to Settings, Select Applications. Select Manage Installed Applications. Select the problematic app or app installer on which you are getting the error. Then select Clear Cache and then Clear Data. Confirm the action. Repeat for other apps. Method 3. Check for Wi-Fi connectivity problems. Make sure the internet service you are connected to is stable and uninterrupted. Ensure the correct password is entered. You can also reboot your modem or router if necessary. Turn off the router, wait for 30 seconds and then turn it back on. This can help resolve any temporary issues with the router. Method 4. Check for updates. Make sure the TV and Fire Stick both are running on the latest available software. First go to Settings and select My Fire TV and select About. Now check for updates on your Fire TV. After that, you can update your Fire TV to the latest version. Once done, the issue might be resolved. Method 5. Free up storage space. Too many unnecessary apps occupy the storage space, leaving the device without enough bandwidth to operate optimally, leading to slow performance. Try deleting some apps you don't need. Go to Settings, then Applications, then Manage Installed Applications. Next, select the app. Here we are showing this app as an example. Select Uninstall and finish the process as shown. Method 6. Connect an Ethernet cable. If your Fire Stick buffers too often, it may be your Wi-Fi network. If you can't use another Wi-Fi network or move your router closer, you can use an adapter to connect an Ethernet cable from your router to your Fire Stick. This can fix issues with slow buffering. Method 7. Force stop background apps. If you can't install certain apps, force stop them. This stops the app from running in the background which can slow down your Fire Stick. Navigate to Settings, select Applications, select Manage Installed Applications. Select the app you want to force stop. Select Force Stop. Method 8. Turn off the Privacy Settings. Open Settings and head to Preferences. Select Privacy Settings. Now the settings here are related to advertising and other purposes. The first settings you get is Device Usage Data. This option use personal data collected by the operating system for this device for marketing and product improvement purposes. Then turn the option off. Next turn off Collect App Usage Data. This option allows App Store to collect information on the frequency and duration if of use of download apps. Then comes the Interest Based Ads option. This option allows apps on this device to use your advertising ID to show interest-based adverts that display products and services that might be of interest to you. So, turn this option on. Next is your advertising ID. This ID is used to create a profile for advertising purposes. Turn this option off as well. Method 9. Stop autoplay for videos and sound. By default, videos and audio will play on the home screen and within apps when you hover over them. You can turn this feature off to reduce the stress on your device. Select Settings, then select Preferences. Select Featured Content. Turn off the Allow Video Autoplay and Allow Audio Autoplay option. Method 10. 
Method 10. Factory reset the fire stick. Go to settings, then select My Fire TV. Next, select Reset to Factory Defaults. Select Reset to confirm your action and let the resetting process complete. Once the resetting process is complete, set it up afresh and the problem should be fixed. Method 11. Disable Collect App Usage Data. Data collection consumes some of the system resources. So, turn off the Collect App Usage Data feature and check if this can help fix the latency issue. Here is how to do so. Open Firestick Settings, select Preferences. Next, select Privacy Settings. If the Collect App Usage Data setting is on, select it to turn it off. Select Turn Off. Method 12. Turn off automatic app updates. Disable automatic app updates for official and third-party apps. Some apps may take up more storage after updating. Unless the app is frozen or buggy, you may not need to update them as often. Do the following. Go to Settings, select Applications, select App Store, turn off automatic updates. Method 13. Control overheating. Make sure your Fire Stick is not overheated. Make sure you are not keeping it in a stuffy room or inside some cabinet. Always keep your device and the fire stick in an airy and well-ventilated room. Check the temperature of the fire stick and if you find it is overheated, unplug the fire stick and allow it to cool down. Once the fire stick cools down, reconnect it and check. Method 14. Maintain the devices regularly. To maintain your Amazon Fire Stick effectively, regularly dust the device using a soft, dry cloth and ensure they are well ventilated to prevent overheating. Regularly check for and install software updates on the device to optimize performance. For the Fire TV Stick, clear the cache of the installed apps to free up storage space and consider a factory reset if persistent issues arise. And there you have it. The way to fix the issue when Amazon Fire Stick is slow. We hope the methods have worked for you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Leave a comment and help others know about the video. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.